right, guys, we are back and we are joined by <laughs> Nazanin Kavari. Thank you for hanging out with us. Thank you for having me. Yeah, I'm so excited. Course. If you guys don't know Nazanin from mm -hmm. her over a million subscribers on YouTube, <laughs> We're just going to reintroduce you to her now because <laughs> we want to, we were chatting all about your recent wedding. Yes, yes. Because your photos oh, are, oh, are so ridiculously so stunning. Happy. Guys. <laughs> How's Look newlywed this? life? <laughs> Honestly, I love being married. And you know, people thought I was crazy because I'm only 20 and I got married, but it's me and my husband, we wanted years and years together. We wanted to have our 40 year anniversary yeah. and our 50, 60 year anniversary. So AJ, uh, nothing but yeah. a number girl. Yeah, Good for yeah. you. And when Thank you know, you, you know. Oh, yeah. yeah, he really is oh. my my soulmate. I know he's watching, so. Oh, Love you, honey. hi, soulmate. <laughs> Hers. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, from your wedding to another wedding mm. we've been talking about all week. Mm -hmm. The Beavers. Yeah, did you know Justin and uh, the Haley are, are I know, the right? Girl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, they got married again, you guys. And yes. uh, we just saw your beautiful wedding photos. Now we're going to take a look at theirs. Uh, first thoughts, what, did, what, what are your thoughts on, on this couple getting married again and what their looks were? I and mean, we don't really, we couldn't see everything. Yeah, we're, we're we only got glimpses details together of a photo booth. Thank you so much, Justin and Haley. They look amazing. I love their look. I heard they got married in North Carolina. South Carolina, South Carolina. Yeah, the no, notebook. The montage, yes. That was so And they sweet had everybody watching the notebook. Yeah. And was it like oh, the actual really? wedding or one of the wedding events? They had everyone watching the That's notebook. So cute. Super inspired by it. Uh-huh. Yeah, sources told ET that their wedding was very sentimental versus expensive. So they uh -huh. went like, you know, where they went the lovey dovey, sentimental, meaningful yeah. route. But I will say there were things that were expensive and that oh, was like, the jewelry. <laughs> like their wedding jewelry. <laughs> Let's right. take a look at some of the amazing pieces we do have the details on. So all of their wedding bands were Tiffany and Company. And the most expensive piece of jewelry that we're actually talking about are the five carat diamond stud earrings that Haley was wearing. They're so beautiful. $123,000 wow. for some big old diamonds. <clears throat> and we were actually saying that her look looks a lot like Meghan Markle's reception look with yeah. her hair tied back that was like that. That was a Stella McCartney That right? was a Stella McCartney mm -hmm. dress. And it's kind of a similar vibe with her low, loose bun. Well, we know earring. that Haley has been inspired by Princess Diana in the past, so I wouldn't be surprised if her wedding reception look was uh, inspired could by Meghan Markle. But did y'all see Justin Bieber had some girls in there? And yes, did, did. did everyone see I that? Loved it. Yes, I love that. Have you ever have you ever tried pull, like would you ever try girls or like if they were like I would diamond look encrusted? So ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I would love to have them in, but people are just gonna be like, what is not Girl, take them out. Yeah, like, <laughs> who are you trying to be right now? I don't Girl, know. Guys. We always love trying new things, right? <laughs> I, I mean when they're on the like little model and you're looking at them and you're like, oh look, they're purple, right. they're actually lavender diamonds. Yeah. And it looks beautiful, but like in your mouth, I'm like, oh right. I don't know, yes. Justin, but on your wedding day. It's a no for me. But you it's know it's a, a no for me, Doug. Yeah, but you know what's a yes for <laughs> yeah, me? It's a yes for me. It's a yes. Oh, it's it is a yes for me. Yes. I, loved, I love that they're doing something different. Different, okay. I love that they're just doing their own thing. Yeah. yeah. That's true. That's we what weddings are all about. Yeah. Weddings need to be like about you as a couple and not everyone what else. everyone else thinks. Exactly. Mm -hmm. um, but a yes for me is the Celine jacket that yes. uh, Haley wore in this photo booth photo right here that oh. says wife. I love this. I a, want that. A, right? <laughs> I, I know you need it. But we unfortunately can't get it because a rep. For, <laughs> so sorry. So sorry. It's custom for her because a rep for Celine tells ET that designer Eddie Slimon designed and created these matching jackets as a wedding gift to Justin and Haley since Eddie has known Justin since 2013 when he shot him for a magazine cover. So this goes way back. This uh, this very special wedding gift, and then now we can't have it. I'm I know, sad. No, I but I'm make sure them, please, I'm sure there are replicas out there that we can get. It's a leather jacket with. Right. Go to the craft Shut store it. after right? and get our little DIY gemstones let's and make Michael's her own. Joanne's Hobby Lobby. This right. after I love it. Uh, all right, you guys, let's take a look at some of the celebs who were in attendance at the Bieber wedding. We have Kendall Jenner on the left over there, and then we have her sister Kylie on the right, and some photo booth action in the middle. You guys, Justine Sky was there. Joan Small. Dan and Shay, so many people, the list goes on and on and on. We um, have a few details about what people were wearing, specifically about their handbags, actually. So we know that Kylie was carrying a Judith Lieber bag, and Judith Lieber bags are known for being totally decked out with Swarovski, in Swarovski crystal, mm -hmm. and hers was a butterfly, so beautiful. And it's a casual $5,000 <laughs> handbag. And then Kendall was carrying a, a bag by Alexander Wang, which was a cool six ninety five. So significantly less. They both significantly less, but also, but also a crazy. lot <laughs> for you know our wallets. <laughs>
One, 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 one of the things about the wedding yes. though is like the gifts that the you gifts. Gift a, get after. And uh, you guys, there was custom. There are custom shirts right here that say the Beavers. Did you guys do any gifts uh, at your after your wedding? Girl, I got married in a courthouse. We oh, yes, I love that. I didn't even we, I guess that. you could say we kind of eloped, but our parents mm -hmm. knew. So. Right, that's so nice. Yeah. But that's like the thing about weddings. But Everybody then, does the wedding the way they do. Their own way, yeah. yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. All right, so if you want to do your wedding a little bit like Hailey Bieber did her wedding, her bachelorette party dress is actually super affordable. This is what her bachelorette party look was. It was super cute. It was like this ruched midi length dress, $56, this dress. So you can get it. Um, so cute. It's super, super cute. And I, actually the whole look we put together with some relatively affordable pieces, shoes by Schutz, which, you know, 155, a little more on the expensive side. The but dress the, is cheaper the than dress that. The dress is cheaper, <laughs> the shoes you're gonna wear a bunch. Um, a bag by Shopo, twenty-seven dollars, and then mm -hmm. these earrings, forty-nine dollars. I so, do love that she went the affordable route. With I the, do too. With the Opali look. Oh golly, Opali, so cheap. <laughs> so cheap, so cute. And like, you know, you want to wear so many different things for your wedding and your mm -hmm. wedding events, but you're probably only going to wear them like once or twice. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. well, do you that's love, that's do you love what you did for the that. Bachelorette, the, the Rouge White? Yeah, I loved it. Like, I totally wear that dress. And Opali is a great brand. But also, I just, when you're Hailey Bieber, like, that's just the ultimate flex. Like, you don't need to flex with your clothes right. and your jewelry. Like, people know. People yeah, know you I love that. Do what you want. You know? And just a fun little throwback too. I love this. Justin actually posted this photo of him and oh Haley from when they were younger, and it's so cute. And he captioned it, "My wife and I, where it all began." They're I feel adorable. like he was feeling uh, nostalgic before uh, before the wedding festivities. But anyway, Nothing. congratulations to the Beavers. They got married <laughs> again Yay. on a Monday, which was so exciting for us. Um, you know, kicked, know, kicked off our week happened. with the wedding. Uh -huh. But um, all right, let's switch gears, you guys, uh, because we noticed a really interesting uh, trend during New York Fashion Week. We wanted to bring it up now um, because it's it's taking over our Instagram feeds. Basically, lacing up your sandals over your pants. And yes. I don't know why I'm pointing because I'm not <laughs> doing it, but lacing up sandals over pants. And it, this leads us to make a decision. Are they or aren't they off the deep trend? <laughs> All right, there Here's are a look. so many images for us to talk about. So we're looking at these while you guys are looking at these. And th this is just an open chat. Okay, I haven't tried this yet. It's a yet. safe space. <laughs> Full disclosure. For all opinions. I have not tried this yet. It's still like 85 degrees here in LA, so I haven't started layering it up mm -hmm. yet. But this kind of started coming out towards the end of the summer mm -hmm. with people doing this. And some of like, I've actually seen some pants and like shoes kind of made this way, like, mm -hmm. or they have ties at the bottom so you can cinch them like this, so, or you can do it with your shoes. No, so what do you guys have you think? tried it? I haven't tried it, but I love it. I think you could rock it. Oh, thank 100%. you. 100%. Thank you. I do too. <laughs> I, I do too. I like it for an edgy nighttime mm -hmm. look. Okay. So I, I'm definitely a fan of that, like with the heels. Mm -hmm. I didn't like flat sandals with the laces. I agree. In the pants. Definitely. I'm not into the flats. Yeah. So yeah. heels, and then obviously like, Skinny jeans or the ones that no, are no, this. Right? Yeah, uh, this is that, like that is the this. look. I, I think wow, you can't I do this with jeans. Wrong. Right. I think it has to be Joggers. a flowy fabric that you can cinch and like uh -huh. get some like fun ruching and like you gotta have the little ruffle action at the bottom. Yo, yeah. I can't even keep my lace ups on my skin, <laughs> let alone <laughs> how it, in the hell am I gonna tie them around a pair of pants? This is a high maintenance trend. <laughs> so <laughs> for me, it's off the deep trend because I can't do it. But see how she has them tied like around and around it's and cute. around. She tied them strategically to stay up. Not, I, you know, yeah, crisscross. Crisscross does not stay up. That's true. Ever. <laughs> oh, I, I kind of like how haphazard it looks, but at the same time, it's obviously purposeful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, for me, it's off the deep trend, like I said, because I can't do it. Marissa? I'm going to say let's try this. Okay. So let's try it, but not with jeans. Your ver final it. verdict? We're all like right. all different opinions. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's the beauty of fashion. Right. Everyone has their own opinion. You can do what you want, mm -hmm. style things the way you want, wear it, own it, all of that. <sighs> all right, you guys. Wow, another episode of ET Style Feed. You guys, coming to an end. That is a wrap. And Fashion Week is over and Fashion Month is over. <laughs> we are done talking about it. The Angel. fashion Don't doesn't do ever stop here on the show. It never stops. <laughs> Next thing we're going to get into is award season. But thanks so much, Nazanine, Thank you for, for having me. Yeah, I had so much fun. Good. We love having you. You can come back anytime. Yes, yes have me back. I'm and like, next we said it's time, almost over. I'm like, aw.
<laughs> I know, I know. It goes by fast. But next time you come, you got to wear your, your little pants I will. with the lace-up shoes. With the, with the lace up shoes. I'm going to change your opinion on it. That's what I'm going to do. Right after we go, get our lymphatic drainage. <laughs> right, <massages>. right. <laughs> Guys, you can keep up with us and mm -hmm. check out what the st Style Squad is up to by mm -hmm. following us on Instagram at Entertainment Tonight. And don't forget, new ET Style Feed episodes drop Wednesdays, 3 p.m. Pacific time. Get out your phone, put it in your calendar right now, and you can catch up on more episodes of Style Feed, which are always available on the ET Live app which you can download for free on your Roku, Amazon Fire, or Apple TV. Wow, I'm out of breath. <laughs> and we're on YouTube too. So we're on YouTube we're everywhere. On YouTube. Shout out to all the style obsessed. We will see you guys next week.